So have you ever wondered how on YouTube thumbnails, people get these really nice outlines around faces, images, and even text? Well, today I'm going to be showing you how you could create these outlines around images and text using the free and open source image editor, GIMP. Welcome to another episode of geekoutdoors.com. On this channel, you'll learn how to be creative and I'll teach you the tools you need to create. So be sure to hit the like and subscribe button to help the channel create more content like this. All right, so on this GIMP tutorial, I'm gonna be showing you how you can easily create outlines around faces or images and text. Now, in this case, I'm gonna assume that you want to create a YouTube thumbnail. So I'm gonna create a very basic and simple YouTube thumbnail, but at the same time, these principles of adding an outline can be applied to any type of thumbnail that you actually want to create for YouTube. Now, GIMP is a free and open source video editor. So if you wanted to use this, regardless of what platform you're using, whether it's Windows, Mac, or even Linux, it is available on all of these platforms. So it's free for you to download and use. And so with that out of the way, we're gonna go ahead and get into GIMP. And since we are gonna be creating a YouTube thumbnail, you wanna be sure that whenever you create your file, you select an image size that is 1280 by 720. So here in the canvas size, I have 1280 by 720, and that is the current dimensions for a YouTube thumbnail. All right, and so the first thing we wanna do here is create an outline around an image, specifically a picture of a face. So this is something that's very popular and obviously I have my face here. And if you're wondering how you could actually remove the background on your images, I did create an entire tutorial on that. And so if you wanted to see that, I will leave that in the description area below. So it's very important that if you are gonna be creating this outline that you want your face with a transparent background. So I highly recommend that you check out that tutorial to do that. Now, once you have your transparent background face, you can now put an outline around it. And so the first thing you wanna do is obviously bring your image into GIMP, which I've already done. And then the next thing you wanna do is you wanna create a background layer underneath your face. And so if you go down here, there is an option called create a new layer, which you could also do right click on your mouse and then create new layer. So either way will work, just say okay. And it's very important that you put that layer below your face. So now I have the layer below my face and it is visible. And the next thing I wanna do is I wanna go ahead and add some color to my background below my face. And so in this case, I already have a color selected. I'm gonna basically drag this down here to the background and boom, I have my background underneath with this specific color. So now that we have that, let's go ahead and start working on the outline around our image or face. And so the first thing you wanna do here is you wanna add another layer above this background layer. So we're gonna do the same thing we did before. You can either right click and add a new layer or you could come down here and create a new layer. It does the same thing. So if you notice, I have another layer, but now it's above my background. Now this part is important. You wanna make sure that your image, in this case, my face is selected. And then the next thing you wanna do is you wanna right click on your mouse and alpha to selection. So this way you'll notice there is an outline around my image and specifically here around my face. So once you have that, this is really important. You're gonna go up here to select, choose this option called grow. And in this case, you could make the number as large as you want, but I'm gonna go ahead and make it five. And what that's gonna do is it's gonna create an outline or grow around this alpha image selection that you had. So the larger the number, the larger the outline around your image. Now, once you have that, the final step is you're gonna go down to that layer that you created below it. And you notice, you know, there's nothing there right now. Here, you could actually choose the outline color that you want to put around your image or your face. So in this case, I'm gonna choose a very popular color of white. All you have to do is drag this down here. And there it is. And so it's very important that you actually have that layer below it selected. And if I hide my face right here, you'll notice that it was around that alpha to selection, which I did earlier at the beginning. So it's very important for you to do alpha selection to your image and then use the select grow option. And finally, on the layer below it, you're gonna go ahead and drag the color that you want. And that's it. That's all it takes for you to add an outline around your image. And obviously you could choose whatever color that you want. 
So say for example, you know, I want it like a yellow color. I could do that as well. And I could go ahead and drag that down here. Boom. And then you could also, you know, just select out here somewhere. And now you could see it without this selection around your image. And so that is all you have to do to create an outline around your image. And so the next step we're going to do is we're going to do the same thing to text. And it's basically the same exact steps that we just did right now. For serious YouTubers, check out TubeBuddy, the premier tool news at geekoutdoors.com. Get more done today by checking out the affiliate link in the description area below. And so the next step is creating an outline around our text. So we're going to basically follow the same steps. The only additional step here is you need to go ahead and add your text. You can use the text tool and add your text. So you could put the text above your face, below your face, wherever you want, but the principles are the same. You're going to create your text first. And then just like your image, you're going to create a layer below that. So in this case, it's above this image. I'm going to add a layer. And now we're going to follow the same exact steps. So I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I'm on my text layer. Then I'm going to right click on my mouse and alpha to selection. And now I'm going to go ahead and go to the select grow and we'll leave it at five. And now we're going to go to the layer below it and add the color that we want. So in this case, I'm going to use a color of black and I'm going to drag this down here and we'll just go ahead and select out here. And there you go. Now we've added an outline around our text and we now have our YouTube thumbnail with this awesome outline around our image or face and around our text. So that is it on how you could create these outlines around your images or text and how you can use this to design some really cool looking thumbnails that actually stick out here on YouTube. So if you actually had any thoughts in this or any other ways in which you create outlines around your images or text, be sure to leave that in the comments area below. And if you did want to see more of my YouTube tutorials and tips, I do have an entire playlist. I'll leave that in the description area as well. So as always, if you did get value out of these videos, be sure to share, like, and subscribe. And if you're a creative geek like me, and you want to get exclusive access to more content that I don't put out here publicly on my YouTube channel, then join my Goal Content Creators Group, where you're going to get content like this and more for all the creative geeks out there. And the best part is, all of this is free. Simply head over to the link below, check out my page, and sign up for my Goal Content Creators Group.